race nine over 1200 meters cape racing class four pineapple mint green the winning horse with me is the winning groom akona the hollywood best moment this is thousand bucks for you akona congratulations nyak bongela and all the best with on the future with everything that was Akona, the winning groom, and congratulations to, of course, to Sean Vili, and of course to Mr. Sands and the Breeding Start Farm, Farce Fonte, and I'm gonna cross over to the team. Number 13, Pineapple Mint Green, another another winner from Give Me the Green Light. Sean Veal's with me. Sean, I've been asked. You need to go through every detail of the race for me. You know, Vicky, the main thing with this filly, you just gotta get it to settle. And uh, I was here la on Tuesday, and I galloped the last week Tuesday. And the gallop was superb, you know. And I said to Mr. Sands, I think she'll go well here. Yeah? I just got to get her to settle. And uh, going through the race, everything worked out perfectly. She came out a little bit better than I wanted it to come out. But uh, halfway through, she sort of spat it out on me. I think they were all worried halfway, because she wasn't really traveling. But they, I knew what I had under me. And a good win, well done to Mr. Sands and his team, to Helen and to his boys. They're doing a fantastic job. And uh, I'm just glad to reward them with winners when I come to the Kalmerson family. Thank you very much for giving Mr. Sands an opportunity. I go way back, obviously, Mr. Dreyer, and now I'm working for Mr. Sands, so uh, I'm very blessed to be in this position I'm in. And uh, to my wife and my two boys, this one's for them. Sean, were you being very patient through your run to make all the connections sweat a little bit? Vicky, you know, she, she, did, she was doing it comfortable. I had to obviously wait for her to give me that kick, which I know she got. At the 200, I knew it was race over because I had my eye on Daniel Musket. I wasn't even really worried about Aldo because I always had him in my sights. But I saw Daniel give a little skip there at about the 300 and I just had to just get really busy on her, you know, and she won a very good race. So well done to everybody concerned. And obviously this one's for my eldest brother, he hasn't been well. One of my biggest supporters, this one's for him. Well done, Sean. Thank you. If he stands here for long, I'll ask him more questions. Eric Sands is going to join me. Eric, well done for the win. Thank you very much. When we spoke leading up to today's meeting, I said, will she be consistent again? And you said, no reason why she won't. She won a good race. Yeah, she won a very good race. Um, I just want to say special thanks to Fast Fontaine and to train for the young group, Anna, John, Charlotte, Alice. Um, it's an honour. It's an honour. It's their first colours and this filly's doing well for them. And she's maturing, so she won a very good race today. Uh, please, may I continue. Eric, well done. Very good training feet. Thank you very much. Well done to Eric Sands and then Susan's going to come. I've been dying to talk to you all day. Well done for the win. No, thank you. And well done to Alice, Charlotte, Hannah and John. And they're watching from wherever they are. Um, they're very excited having their first horses. And it's an honour to lead in for one for them. Is there a fair amount of family banter leading up to whenever Pineapple, Pineapple Mint Green's nominated? Oh, yeah, yeah. Sometimes she's been running against a filly that's in John's and my colours, and so then there was some banter. So even when they were, like, finishing, what, seventh and eighth, yeah, they were happy. They beat us and things like that. So, so it's starting. We're getting them interested. I suppose it's all the fun about it. That's what it is. It's about racing with family. It's about racing with friends. And it, it just adds the extra bit of excitement. Absolutely. And these are Hannah's colours. And uh, John's colours have been with uh, Chichi Canstenango, with Gareth Van Zale. And the two-year-olds in training now will be in Alice's colours and ha uh, Charlotte's colours. So they've all had their fun designing their colours. And I hope lots of other younger people get involved too, whenever they can, as soon as they can. But it's looking promising and, uh, and also very exciting. A good day for you from Fast and Tain Stud? Great day for us, for Gimme. Uh, we've, we've had a feature race winner that we bred and we won. We raised four Lady Laidlaw as well. So we're going to go and celebrate. <laughs> well deserved. Well done. Okay. Thanks, Vicky. Okay. Well then to Susan Rout from Fast Montaigne Stud. Lovely to have her join us. Or oh, um, I should rather say Kalmanson. But uh, with, with regards to number 13, Pineapple Mint Green. Lovely win from the Philly. Well done to Eric Sands getting her to peak on a brilliant day. Lovely to have Susan on course. The, the entire Fast Montaigne team is standing next to me at the, the stand. It's so wonderful to have their support and and, uh, that's race nine. Next up is the Kai Stables Work Riders and Jockeys Championship. Looking forward to how that's going to go. There's a point system, so stay tuned with who's going to be on the up. The Work Riders are 2-0 to the Jockeys, so they've got it all to defend.